Oh, we're 95% complete as well for the uh, community challenge. Is it capturing the game? Why aren't you capturing the game? Oh, yeah, it is. There we go. Uh, ZMP, thank you for the follow, my friend. Welcome to the channel. Uh, hope you enjoy your time here. And we're a hundred percent complete. Uh, so we'll do a Harry Potter stream, a full Harry Potter stream. Uh, if we make good progress on this, we, as in like we've got one stream left of Silent Hill, we'll probably complete Silent Hill and then we'll play uh, Harry Potter, if that's okay with you guys. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not, MG. Uh, not at the moment, anyway. Oh, Zen, go and sleep, my friend. I know you're in Hawaii, so it's like early morning. Right, for those who weren't here at the end of the last stream, uh, uh, we've we've uh, we've just got to the hospital section. Uh, so yeah, Harry Potter stream has been achieved really quickly as well. Uh, I might have to set the points even higher. Uh, so we'll do a community stream day again. Uh, probably similar to what we did with my birthday. Uh, but we'll play a whole day of Harry Potter. Uh, in fairness. Oh, cutscene. Hold it. Stop. Don't shoot. Wait. I'm not here to fight. My name is Harry Mason. I'm in town on vacation. Thank God. Another human being. Do you work here? I'm Dr. Michael Kaufman. I work at this hospital. Joe, so thank you, you very much, my friend. On. I really can't say. I was taking a nap in the staff room. When I woke up, it was like this. Everyone seems to have disappeared. And it's snowing out this time of year. Something's gone seriously wrong. Did you see those monsters? Have you ever seen such aberrations? Ever even heard of such things? You and I both know creatures like that don't exist. Yeah. Have you seen a little girl anywhere? I'm looking for my daughter. She's only seven. Short, black hair. She's missing. I'm sorry. But with all those monsters around, I highly doubt that she's... Sorry, I didn't mean to alarm you. Your wife, she's here with you? She died four years ago. Now it's just me and my daughter. I see. I'm sorry. No worries, MJ. Well, I'd better be going. I can't just sit around here doing nothing. So long. Good luck out there. Thank you, Joe, for that gift subscription. That means, I believe now, we have got enough sub points to unlock a new remote. 
Uh, so we can finally get the uh, smooth emote. Uh, so thank you very much, Joe. I believe that's the case anyway. Might not be, but we'll see. Uh, and if you're not following Joe, please go follow Joe as well. He's a really great streamer. Good friend of the channel. Uh, but yeah, how are you doing today, Luna? Have you got school? Thanks for the shout out, Luna. I hope your lecture went okay. I've got my first lecture tomorrow, tomorrow afternoon. Should be, uh, should be okay, I think, hopefully. Uh, I hope your homework goes okay as well. It's very creepy here, isn't it? Like, it's kind of like a low. Low generating hum. A basement map. Anything else in here? We got a test tomorrow. Okay. Good luck with your test tomorrow. Basement key. Good luck with it, Luna. Uh, I, I, I honestly, I'm terrible with tests. I'm really bad. I can't. I, I fall apart during tests. It's the pressure, I think. I can do essays and stuff quite willingly and quite enjoy them, but I don't like tests. And yeah, the last time we played this game, uh, a user, Cosmic Jellyfish, I believe his name was, uh, told me that we need to get a jar to get this liquid. Because this liquid is quite important later on. We're getting one of the correct endings. That's in. 
director's office. Sounds very omni ominous, doesn't it? That sound. Going to any of the doors down here, then can we? We'll try the generator room. I love how this game uses uh, abstract sounds to kind of really put the tension up. So I'm going to go in the kitchen again because I think it's in here where we can get that glass. Maybe one of these? Yeah. Okay, now we can pick the liquid up. Was not there. That one maybe? Yeah. Uh, Cause this is the ending, I've never got this ending. So I'm gonna go for this one. Remaining liquid is emptied into the plastic bottle. Now what have we here? Indeed, Harry. What do we have? Unknown liquid. Red liquid found in a broken vial in the hospital director's room. I really love how missable that is as well. Uh, now we had Vegapunk in the channel the other day. Uh, and he pointed out that when we go to the other world, I believe, the elevator gains a fourth floor. Uh, now in Japanese, uh, the number four is... Uh, associated with death and hell and the underworld and all that sort of stuff. And to realise that every floor the doors are locked. Maybe. 
Okay, in the basement. What does yawn mean, Stampy? See, now we've gained a fourth floor. Never in the other world. Hear a door locked behind us. Lock is jammed. No worries, Joe. Enjoy your dinner, my friend. That means four in Japanese, so okay. All the doors are locked. Means we can only go forward now. E for one, oh, okay. Hey Vega, how's it going man? That's a uh, dropping by. Do we get a map? Oh, we've got a map. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Really enjoying it. Uh, I'm kind of getting ready to uh kind of gearing up now to to get to my favorite one in the franchise which is Silent Hill 2 uh but likewise I'm really excited to play Silent Hill 3 for the first time okay so I think we should probably go back in this room and kind of check out How's your day going there, Vega? Hope you're having a really good one. Yeah, I think it's going to be a really good uh, stream. I think that one. Uh, honestly, I am I'm really looking forward to playing it. I love playing games for the first time. Uh, there's nothing quite like it. I think it'll be my first game that I've played completely for the first... Oh no. That's a lie actually. I played Parasite Eve for the first time on Twitch, which was really fun. Uh, I really would like to play Parasite Eve again, especially now we've got some people coming into the chat, because I feel like that's such a game. Uh, 
honestly Vega final boss aside and how annoying it was uh, a parasite Eve well not final boss but final final the, the pre-final boss uh, that was an absolute nightmare uh, some of the controls were quite dated uh, but overall that game yeah I'm going to play it again I quite like to play the others but I've heard they're a bit shit so I know Parasite Eve 2 is more Resident Evil esque than the first one uh, but the first one I'm not a big JRPG fan but really fucking loved playing it uh, I had some pretty good people uh, join along to those streams as well. Got me a. Uh, yeah. Uh, Project, what's that? What's the vibe with that one? Is it kind of in the vein of Silent Hill? I'm more into atmospheric horror games than like, uh, like jump scare or like the uh, Outlast type stuff of modern horror. Uh, I really didn't like Resident Evil 7, for instance, but I really like Resident Evil 2. The remake. Nothing helpful, this ammo right there. Oh, Fatal, I've heard of Fatal Frame, never played them, but uh, yeah. I'm, I'm usually a bit of a pansy with horror games, but I do like the vibes. I'll, I'll certainly consider it. Uh, We want to keep on the uh, on the kind of list. The rest of this year is looking pretty packed. Uh, we're going to be playing Metal Gear in December and Demon Souls before that. Uh, we've got to try and fit in a Harry Potter stream now, so <laughs> that's going to be fun. My main worry right now is balancing Twitch and my uh, finishing my master's degree. Uh, but I'm quite confident with the new schedule. I should be able to do it. Pokemon Red's pretty old though. That's like... Uh, two, two, two decades old now. I actually played one of my first games I played on stream uh, was uh, Pokemon Silver and it was a horrible experience to stream. I streamed Pokemon Silver for two hours and I just had one person come in, uh, tell me I sound really bored and then they left. I was like, okay. Guess I'm not streaming Pokemon anymore.
Uh, Persona seems very really good. I've enjoyed what I've seen of uh, MG playing it. I don't want to go in here yet. Uh, I know uh, the, if you get the PlayStation 5, you get Persona 5 with it for free. Uh, if you're a PlayStation subscriber or whatever. Fuck was that? Cross the swing on the lad. <laughs> Interesting, you can't kill this guy. Oh, is it because there's someone else? Ah. I don't know the difference, honestly, ZMP. Uh, you get extra deal. You get the DLC, don't you, with Royal? It's one of those games that I really like the soundtrack and I would actually like to try the game out. Uh, but I just, I don't think I could stream the game. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it's not a game I'd like to stream. Uh, I don't really like streaming uh, JRPGs. I had like a really bad experience playing uh, Yakuza. I just find it not fun to play. Uh, which is a shame because I love Yakuza. Yeah, that was not a good time for me. Okay, that's cool. Sound is heard from beyond the door. Hmm. Interesting. I don't think we can do much more here, maybe. Door is locked. I guess we can make our way to the second floor though from uh, with these uh, stairs. Yeah, we can. Game's not too loud, is it? By the way, 
Uh, Cause these gunshots are really loud for me. No, okay, that's good. Uh, the Grim Reapers list. 35, Lydia Findlay. 60, Trevor F. White. 18, Albert Lords. 45, Roberta T. Morgan. 38, Edward C. Briggs. I wonder if these names hold any significance. Uh, because uh, Vega the other day pointed out that the street names were all named after uh, quite uh, esteemed sci-fi writers and horror writers. Yes, we'll take the lighter. Lock is jammed. Lock is jammed. Lock is not jammed. Ah, I remember. No. Yes. Feed on the blood of the innocent. Is uh, Persona the only game you play, MP? Slate. Nothing more than that. Clouds flowing over a hill, sky on a sunny day, tangerines that are bitter, lucky four-leaf clover, violets in the garden, dandelions along a path, unavoidable sleeping time, liquid flowing from a slashed wrist. Okay, I vaguely remember this from the last time we played. I think we've got all four kind of tiles. Okay, so let me write this down. Using my handy mobile communications device. Why is my phone just auto-corrected tangerines to ya heroes? I feel like this is a colour puzzle again though, so I may actually need chat's help because I am hilariously colour blind.
only play League, but this summer I decided to play some RPs. Oh, okay. Uh, Ghost of Tsushima. You know what? I started Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, I haven't even got past the first area. I got really, uh, really bored. It's a lot. Therefore, yeah, it's a colour puzzle. So, clouds is white. Sky on a sunny day. Uh... Would that be blue? Tangerines that are bitter, so that'll be like orange, if that's orange. Lucky four leaf clover, so that needs to be green. Violets are done. Dandelions. Is that the colour of a dandelion? Yeah, I don't know what fucking colour dandelions are. I think it's because I struggle with open world games because I tend to like... I, it was such a good looking game. I just wandered about a lot and did like all the side shit and then I got all the upgrades from the get go. So even on hardcore, I was just obliterating everyone. Uh, but now I've got the capture card, we can play Ghost of Tsushima and stuff on stream. It might be a game that I enjoy more on stream, I don't know. Run. Is that the new one they added in a patch? I haven't played it since a patch. I've only played it like when it first came out. I think it's hardcore or whatever it's called. My controller's vibrating so we should use a health drink. There's only one fight I really struggled with. Uh, from the, the small section that I played, uh, which was a duel with this guy who could use like, well I don't know if he could use, but he had like lightning with strike in the arena you were in. Really cool looking fight. Really enjoy playing it in black and white as well. The disinfecting alcohol. give it a go. Hardcore was fine honestly until I got like loads of upgrades and then you can just parry everyone. I felt like the parry timing as well was like the window was so huge it became really easy to parry. Whereas like with Sekiro you have to have perfect parry timing. I think I'd rather play Sekiro again, honestly, than Ghost of Tsushima. Because I really fucking love Sekiro. 
so much. That game is, it's not like, oh, we got a key, didn't we? Basement storeroom, okay. Sekiro's not as good as Bloodborne, but it's like, fucking, it's fucking up there. Yeah, DS3 is very really good. I want to go back through the, my plan for next year, the big, uh, the big playthrough for next year. How long it takes us, I don't know. Uh, we're going to play through, oh shit. I want to play through all the Dark Souls games again. So, Dark Souls 1 to 3. I've never played the DLC for 2 or 3. So, those will be completely blind. Uh, but I want to do like a big lore playthrough of them as well. Similar to what we're doing with Silent Hill. Uh, kind of, I'm moving the focus of this channel into like... Uh, Gonna be doing like big series playthroughs where we take them nice and slow and we kind of uh, analyze and do some deep dives. Oh, I'm getting ganked. Getting ganked. Oh, God. Getting absolutely. Oh. Well, they can't see me in the dark. Come to. Check the body out. Leave the dead body be. We've really been playing for an hour already. Yeah, well, I'll uh, I'll get to check it out. To be honest, something I do really want to play is uh, Last of Us uh, Part Two. But I want to replay the first again. Uh, not as far as I'm aware. Uh, why? I don't think PC will ever be back out. I need to hack your PS4 now to make it work. Uh, custom firmware. Oh, it's never been not on Twitch. People have been playing PT, and people have still got PT. If they never uninstalled it, you can still play PT. Uh, but you can uh, get custom firmware on your PS4 to get PT running. Uh, but honestly, I, unless you're like a Silent Hill streamer, I would probably advise against getting custom firmware just to play P2. Uh, just because... MG, you played Last of Us Part 2, haven't you? Okay. What if I can use... Not finished yet. I was just wondering how long it is.
Although to be honest, I don't think I've got the money for it. Thirty four oh okay, far too long then. Far too long. We need something to kind of fill the gap between uh Silent Hill 3 and Demon Souls. Modded MC. Minecraft. Okay. I was actually watching a streamer called uh, Koku uh, play Minecraft yesterday. Uh, in fact, if they are streaming today, I don't know if they are. Uh, I quite like to raid them a bit. the share at Luna. Yeah, they're very, very close to making uh, affiliate now. Uh, I was hanging out in their stream yesterday. Really fantastic. Uh, lovely person. Fucker, there's nothing there. Yeah, I did. I'm always on my best behaviour in like everyone's streams. And why you have this reputation of me, Luna. I am a well behaved boy. In every stream I visit. This? Looks like someone's been here. Alessa. Alessa. Examination room key. I'm like, uh, I don't know. Nothing about that game's grabbed me really. Yeah, if you haven't owned PT, then you can't get it back. Uh, I don't think you can even pirate it. The game's lost forever. Uh, honestly though, someone who's played PT, it is fucking terrifying for sure. But, like, uh... Oh man, you got a PS4 late in the game then, didn't you? Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, as soon as play PC, it's kind, it's it's cool, but like. Like, it is just like a demo. Uh, I, I don't think you miss anything by playing it on... by just watching a YouTube or someone playing it. Personally, that's my opinion. Uh, in PT, essentially you're in first person mode and you have to... keep going around in circles in this uh, corridor in your house. Also, good night as well, yeah. Uh, eventually, uh, you figure out some puzzles and you unlock the front door to your house. Uh, at which point... Uh, welcome back, Joe. Uh, when you figure out the puzzles... Oh, we can't leave the door. Interesting. Uh, but yeah, eventually when you leave the house, it's revealed that the character you're playing as is Norman Reedus. Uh, it's also insinuated in the game. Uh, that you have murdered your wife and uh, your unborn baby. As uh, eventually one of the puzzles reveals that there is a crying fetus in the sink of the of your house. It's all very weird. It was a uh, sorry cutscene. Who's okay? Who are you? Yeah, we'll be live for a little bit, MJ. Enjoy your dinner. My name's Lisa Garland. What's yours? Harry Mason. Harry, tell me what's happening here. Where is everybody? I must have gotten knocked out. When I came to, everyone was gone. It's awful. So you don't know anything either. Great. I just don't get it. It's like this is all some kind of bad dream. Yeah, a living nightmare. Let me ask you, have you seen a little girl around here? Short, black hair, seven years old? I said welcome back, Chef. What Chef for dinner, mate? She's your daughter? Yes. A seven-year-old girl. I can't say that I have. I was unconscious all this time. I'm sorry. <sighs> That's all right. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Do you know anything about all that weird stuff in the basement? No. Why? Is there something down there? You don't know? Don't you work here? We're under strict orders never to enter the basement storeroom. So I really don't know. What did you say was down there? Well, it's... <clears throat> Damn! My head... What's wrong? Harry? Harry, let me help you. Harry? Was I dreaming? You were too late. It's you. Yes, Dahlia Gillespie. Tell me everything you know. What's going on? Darkness. 
like the town is being devoured by darkness. Strength must overcome petty desire, childish sleep talk. I knew this day would come. What are you talking about? I don't understand a word of this. Believe the evidence of your eyes. It's the other church in this town, that is your destination. This is beyond my abilities. Only you can stop it now. Have you not seen the crest marked on the ground all over town? So that's what I saw in the schoolyard. What does it mean? It is the mark of Samael. Don't let it be completed. Hey, wait! Oh man, I just checked uh, the stream stats and we are like, we're actually one sub away now from, uh, from the emotes. Uh, we haven't made the emote yet. It must not count resubscriptions, which is uh, a shame. Or maybe it'll update after the stream's finished with whoever's with the gift subs and shit. Antique shop key. Fingers crossed anyway. But yeah, hope you enjoyed your leftovers, Joe. That's a dog. That's a doge. Ooh. Hey Fat Frank, how's it going man? Yeah, you're a sub now. Uh, Joe gifted you a sub earlier. Uh, you now have access to the snake first emotes. Whoa! And just maybe, when we hit the next goal, which is one sub away, we will, uh, we can have a second emote. Is peace stored in the balls? Uh, according to a popular science, it is. Oh, Loon's going to come out alert now and absolutely beat the shit out of me. I've mentioned the forbidden word. Where the fuck is this antique shop? Top right. I'm sorry, Luna. I know. It's a fucked up soundtrack, isn't it? Though? Is that a rat eating the sun?
No worries, Joe. Thanks, sir. Uh, thanks for sticking on the alert, though. It is appreciated. What's this? Harry! Sybil? Oh, I'm glad you're okay. I shouldn't have left you. Things are worse than I thought. It's nuts. What are you doing here? I thought you left town. I saw you go in here, so I followed you. I couldn't get out. All the roads out of town are blocked. Cars have completely stopped running. The phones and radios are still out, too. What about my daughter? Did you see her? I did see a girl. Was it Cheryl? I only caught a glimpse of her through the fog. I went after her, but she vanished. I don't know about your daughter, but... And you just let her go? Where was it? On Bachman Road. She was heading towards the lake. Now don't get excited. It wasn't like she ran off exactly. There was no place for her to go. The road has been obliterated. What? So then Cheryl... It was like she was walking on thin air. What about you? Anything? Yeah, I met this bizarre woman. Her name's Dahlia Gillespie. Do you know her? Dahlia Gillespie? No. And? She said something about the town being devoured by darkness. Gibberish like that. Any idea what it means? Darkness devouring the town? Must be on drugs. They sell them to the tourists. The force still can't figure out who's behind it. None of our leads have panned out. And the investigation is stalled. What could drug trafficking have to do with all this? I really don't know. But maybe that's the darkness she was talking about. That's all I can think of. Hmm. What's this? Just discovered it. Maybe there's something back there. Let's have a look. Wait. We don't know what's back there. I'd better check it out first. I'm a cop. I should go. No. I'm going. All right. I'll cover you from here. Be careful. If anything looks fishy, get back here on the double. Okay. Sybil? Yeah? Do you know anything about... Well, like some other world, it's like some kind of bad dream. What are you talking about? I'm not quite sure. I try to make sense of it, but then my mind goes blank. Everything's dark there, and I hear sirens in the distance. I met this nurse, Lisa. It's like I was there but not really. It's all a blur, like some kind of hallucination, you know? I have no idea what you're talking about, Harry. Oh. I was just wondering. Never mind. Harry, you're tired. Yeah, maybe. Mm. 
Hmm. Hey, Koku, how's it going, man? How you doing? Welcome into the uh, welcome to the old channel. Yeah, we're doing Maybe pretty good. This is the other church. Uh, we were just talking about you actually earlier. Uh, wondering if you were going to be streaming today. Uh, someone's talking about uh, mod modded Minecraft in the chat. Uh, so we gave you a little, little shout out. Some kind of power. Or powder, sorry. Oh, some kind of powder is left in the chalice. I don't know about you guys. That is a is that a fucking axe? <gasps> that is an axe. No worries, Luna. Take care. Powder in the chalice. I think the uh, the church people are into uh, into the drugs. Fucking axe. I wonder if we can light the powder actually. There's a lighter. to the hell world some metal grates blood and bondage from here oh we're back at the hospital where am i harry lisa then i'm in the hospital you were having a bad dream was i hey you don't look too good are you okay? I'm fine. Nothing you need to worry about. Well, if you're sure... Lisa, do you know a woman named Dahlia Gillespie? Oh yeah, that crazy Gillespie lady. She's kind of famous around here. She never sees anybody, so I don't know that much about her. But I heard her kid died in a fire, and supposedly she's been crazy ever since. Well, she says the town is that being kind of sounds people crazy. Darkness. Do you have any idea what she's talking about? A town devoured by the darkness. Yes, I think I do. Before this place was turned into a resort. The townspeople here were on the quiet side. Everybody followed some kind of queer religion. Weird occult stuff. Black magic, that kind of thing. As young people moved away, the people figured they'd been summoned by the gods. Evidently, things like that used to happen around here all the time. Before the resort, there really wasn't anything else out here. Everyone was so flipped out, you gotta blame it on something. Then a lot of new people came in and everybody clammed up about it. A cult? Last time I heard anything about it was, gosh, 
years ago. When several people connected with developing the town died in accidents, people said it was a curse. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm rambling. I'll shut up. I love it, casual trees. Did I pass out again? I don't want to think so, but maybe this is all just going on in my head. I could have had a car accident and now I'm laying unconscious in a hospital bed. I don't know what's real anymore. Sybil said Cheryl was heading towards the lake, but the road to the lake is blocked. Aren't there any other roads? Lisa would probably know. Uh, that's how I sleep at night, Kokyu. Uh, chained up by barbed wire in a flesh suit. It's the best way to sleep, I find. Uh, but yeah, I love how like casual Lisa is. It's like, oh yeah, a uh, fucking kid died in a fire in it. Been a bit weird since then, like, but you know. Just all casual about it. Exactly, Koki. Like, oh, just, just a kid dying in a fire. Just a kid dying in a fire. That's rude, Luna. That's very rude. Sorry about that. Oh, monkey boys. Oh. Oh. Get in the hole, Harry. Get in the hole. Well, that's not unsettling. Oh, Moncares is in the chat.
shit. Fuck, it's the fucking worm. isn't uncertain in this game. Oh, I wish I knew, Luna. I wish I knew. This game is... Oh, come on. Help, please. Give me that monster energy. Oh, I can do a little... I can do a little hop, I didn't know that. Bullets. Tomorrow night, that Ray's playing Resident Evil, isn't it? I really want to watch Ray play Resident Evil. I'm so excited. She has got so much pain to come with that game. I can't remember if it was tonight or oh, there's birds or tomorrow. I'm pretty sure it's tomorrow. Dogs. Run, Harry. Oh, dogs. Oh, why is there so many fucking dead ends? Yeah, so that's not on her channel though, is it? It's on someone else's channel. I think. Get in there, Harry.
This might be a really fucked up cutscene right now. Harry! But it might not be. Glad you're okay. Thank God you came back. I was scared to be here all alone. I'm here now. I was worried too. I'm real happy to see you. Lisa, can you tell me how to get to the lake? The lake? You take Bachman Road. The road's blocked. Well, that's the only way out there. Are you sure? There's gotta be another way. Wait! I just remembered something! What? There's a waterworks over by my old elementary school. It's been abandoned for years. There's an underground tunnel out there, used for inspections or something. I remember hearing it runs all the way to the lake. Really? You think I can get to the lake from there? I've never been down in there myself, so I'm not positive. Besides, it's all fenced off to keep people out. If there's a chance, I've got to try. Harry, don't go! I don't want to be alone. It's so scary, I can't stand it. How about coming with me? This may not be the safest place in the world either. I can't promise you anything, but I'll do my best to protect you. No, somehow I feel I'm not supposed to leave this place. Oh, Harry, I'm so scared. I'm cold. Look, just wait here a little longer. Be back as soon as I find my daughter. Harry? Glad I chose to uh, take my hoodie off during the cutscene with the camera off so I didn't expose my nipples on stream. Uh, also, yeah, anyone anyone lurking, not in the Discord? Uh, we've got a Discord, it's pretty fun to hang out in. Join us. Or Luna will threaten you. Hey, Gary, how's it going, my friend? Yeah, costume change and everything. Uh, I was getting a bit warm in the hoodie. So I went to, went to lighten up. How's your day going, Gary? Mellow hype. Mellow hype be lurking. How you doing, buddy? Haven't seen you for a while. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for the lurk, though. I appreciate it. Luna, type the most threatening thing in chat that you can think of right now. That isn't obviously like TOS. Fuck, I thought that was a good scene. Oh, shit. Oh, is Gary going to be streaming again? Also, DMC5, what a fucking game. I know I saw some of your tweets about it. Oh, it's trying to stick me. Yeah, Luna, just put the most threatening thing you can think of. Oh, fucking shit back. Hop away! Oh, it's trying to stick me with its... Whatever the fuck that is at the end of a butterfly's scrotum. Oh, 
some photography. Uh, I'm pretty sure in the, you're in the Discord. We have an art, art thing in the Discord, so I'd love to see some photography in there. Uh, also, yeah, I saw you uh, tweeting about DMC5. Fucking love that game. I want to go through and do uh, Sons of Sparta. I did start it. Exactly, and you don't want any of that. Because one, we like having Luna here. Best mod in the business of Twitch. Uh, don't tell MJ. But Luna's best mod. Uh, and just, just, it's Luna. We love Luna. Okay, let, let's turn this into type your best threats in the chat that aren't TOS. Like, nothing too, like... Uh, so, I, I want to hear your best threats that aren't, like, actual. That isn't going to get yourself banned. Uh, because be careful, Luna may seem adorable. But, but she knows her way around a band blade. I can assure you. Uh, right, where the fuck am I going now? I have no fucking idea. Are we trying to make our way to the lake? Maybe go back to the hospital? doing some photography as well, Luna. Okay. Lisa's gone. Guess we'll just have a wander. Post office there in red. Usually, red buildings mean we can go in them. Let's go and see if we can go in the post office. hospital stuff that we can do. Okay, we can't. Now, I don't know much about America, but for an American town, that seems like an awfully 
British post office sign to me. Luna, does that look like a, an American post office sign with the red and yellow? Because that traditionally is like the British post office. That's a better look. Yeah, so I was thinking it looks quite Royal Mail, that one. Always look. What the fuck are you bringing up here then? Not even close. Yeah, I think they must have took uh, inspiration from from us British for that one. Right, I am. Let's just have a look at the map. Does it? I haven't played Saints Row 2 in really since it first came out. Whenever that was, a long time ago. I mean, there is a red thing above the tea room, so on Simmons Street. So we'll go down Coontz Street. We'll have a jolly down here. I cannot believe it's Wednesday already. Like this week's going really fast, I think. Ooh, monkey. Oh, that looks awkward. Completely missed it because that guy's been. Oh, get off. You know what? We'll probably. Oh, we're being assaulted by everyone right now. I feel like it's going really quick. Like a week since my birthday. Almost. Okay, so I can't get through there. I might have to ask for help in a minute. Possibly. Try the uh, town centre again. Have a little bit of a gander around there. Where's the shopping mall? Oh, it's sealed up. Is that a shopping mall? Yeah. I mean, we could go back in here. Lock is jammed. That road's full. Ah, oh, hmm.
maybe I've just not paid attention properly. at this place at the end of the last stream so and the only street we haven't been up is this one which is fucked as well so People of Sight Hill need to look after their roads. Your fucking roads, mate. to transport you back here, that's interesting. Good job we got a fucking axe. large share of that. Ain't that the truth, Gary? Oh, the scary music's happening again, folks. Scary music time. I must get about 20 emails from my university each day, none of them relevant to my course, or indeed of any useful information at all. Can I unsubscribe from them? Nope, I cannot. Argue Barmy is my friend, how's it, going to, how's it going to you as well? It's going really well, I'm having a really good time today. Uh, just playing through the original Silent Hill, taking a, a nice slow little tour through the game, trying to piece together any hidden symbolism. How are you doing? Uh, Luna, can we get a shout out for Argy Barmies? Uh, really cool streamer. Had possibly... Had possibly one of the most Twitch moments ever the other day. Uh, so yeah, never killed these. Uh, so I was in Argue Barmy's chat, the uh, channel the other night, 
There's a fella in there called Ant Chapman. Uh, I don't know how it happened, uh, but it basically uh, came to light that Ant Chapman was one of the fellas who wrote... Uh, I don't know if you'll know it, Luna. I don't know if it reached the States, but in the UK it was a very popular song uh, called Eat My Goal. Uh, it was like a super popular song. And it was just like this mad realisation of like, one, is this guy legit? Uh, and then when we did, it was just uh, a very incredible moment. The moment you'll only have happen on Twitch. It was the most Twitch thing ever. Uh, but yeah, glorious. Uh, but Ant's a lovely streamer. Uh, he streams Football Manager on a Monday. I don't even like football. I don't know anything about football. But I like hanging out there just because the... Uh, like I said, the conversation's really good. Uh, so he is a stream I recommend. He does play a variety of things. On all different days. Uh, hey MG, how's your dinner? What do you have nice? Oh, is it in the oven? Uh, what are you cooking nice? Nah, it's all good, man. It's all good. I'm, I'm really... Uh, I'm kind of discover. I've been on Justin TV for so long, uh, but I feel like in the past year, uh, UK Twitch, certainly since lockdown, has got like really fucking good, and everyone's got their own like different vibes as well, which is what I really like. Uh, I like what Box Social's doing with the spacing now. Hopefully, you can make it work. Uh, Ah, oh, sounds really good as well, MJ. I'm starting to get a bit hungry now. I did have some soup before stream, which was lovely. Uh, you're all great, are you, to Like, UA, uh, yourself, uh, cactus snacks, uh, quesads. Uh, you're all really, honestly. Uh, and I've only been streaming for like, for, actually, I forgot to say, it's actually three months today since I started streaming on Twitch. Uh, and being welcomed so warmly by everyone, uh, it has been really great. Uh, and, and especially Box as well, with him really pushing like what he can make out of Twitch. Uh, Thank you, Argue. Uh, but yeah, with like what Box is doing, it's really inspired me to try and nail down what I want to do with the channel, which is kind of like these super long series playthroughs of games like Metal Gear Solid and uh, Silent Hill, uh, Demon Souls. We're going to do a big Dark Souls, all boss, all DLC lore playthrough next year. Uh, so yeah, like games in the week. And then on Sundays now we're doing the Sunday sessions where I'll play vinyl. Uh, and we've got the record. You can't really see it. It's in darkness. We've got a record player set up. Uh, and we'll play records. And, and it's just like a space to chill and hang out and kind of work on. Like last week I worked on stream overlays. Uh, while listening to vinyl and chatting with people in the chat. I like that Twitch allows me to do that stuff. And as someone who's been shielding from the coronavirus... And probably will be shielding again. Like I haven't actually left the house properly since March. Uh, Twitch has like allowed me to have friends and communicate with people. Thank you, Luna. Thank you, everyone, as well. Uh, we've almost got a second emote slot this month as, as well. Uh, but I am cautious that it's just because it's my birthday this month. Well, it has. Whoa. Uh, just cautious like was because my birthday we've had such a big spurt of growth uh, but I do appreciate everyone who's been like supporting the channel the past month uh, it, like the support from everyone's been amazing like these last two years for me especially has been like such a whirlwind uh, like trying to get a master's degree and stuff like that 
which is something I never thought I'd be able to do. This place is so confusing. Sewer levels are always confusing. Like these past two, two years for me have been like really like pushing myself. Uh, the most I've pushed myself in a long time. As someone who's home educated with like no GCSEs. The fact I've been able to get myself a degree and now hopefully working towards a masters and now doing this twitching as well. Oh that's scary. Yeah, Twitch has been amazing. Uh, I really hope when the world kind of slowly returns to normal, a lot of people stick around. Uh, but I think they will. Man, I'm fucking lost in this place. MG, you should post some pics in the uh, Discord because that looks really nice and tasty. Or sounds really nice and tasty. Yeah, I I'm really enjoying it. I mean, I've not started back on my like final few terms. I start tomorrow, actually, my first lecture. So I'm hoping I can balance Twitch and this. Uh, which is what I, I was streaming like pretty much every day. Uh, but now I'm just streaming on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. And the Sunday show obviously. Uh, but one of the ideas behind the Sunday show as well was it allows me to be on Twitch. And I can read a book and study at the same time. Okay. And from doing it last Sunday, a lot of people really enjoy it as well. It's like MG uh, works on like YouTube videos and stuff. Uh, so he was able to finish editing his video while hanging out and listening to to the vinyl records and we were listening to. I really like some of the music stuff that's going on right now, like with Box's spacing. Uh, I did mention in Box's channel. And UA seemed quite into it. It's like maybe eventually we'll do like a a Twitch radio or something for UK. Uh, with a bunch of us just doing different kind of talk shows or something. But that'd be quite cool. Get me out of here. Are you streaming tonight, Argue? Okay, no worries. Uh, well, I'm glad you decided to stop by, uh, even if just for a little bit. Uh, I really appreciate it. Claustrophobic.
Give him a good kick in. Come on, Harry. I feel like I have to go this way first. Resorting to the map, I'm getting so confused. There's a sewer exit key in the water, take it. Oh, yep. Whoa. Fucking hell. Run. Because I've got such an empty head, uh, I don't think Koki is still here. Is, did Koki say he was streaming tonight? Holy shit, that was a loud noise. He's working a lot more yesterday, so I don't I don't know if he is. But I'd really like if we could try and get him to affiliate tonight. That'd be very cool, I think. Oh he is streaming, okay. Uh well I'm probably gonna wrap it up in about half an hour. How long is 2 EST from now? Okay, good then. I think all he needs is average views. So if we can help him out tonight, anyone in the chat, if there's still people left by then, then I think that would be a really nice thing to do. Just seen his notification actually of him going live. Oh, cutscene. Are you okay? Yeah, I guess so. 
But I'm beat. I thought I was a goner there. So how'd it go? Did you find a way out? No, not yet. How about you? Zip. But it's too soon to give up. This craziness can't go on forever. A military rescue squad should be here any time now. If they come through the town, we're home free. I hope so. I better get going. This isn't the time to stand around flapping our gums. Do you know a girl called Alessa? No. I think he's lying. Uh, that's fine, Lyra. Uh, we will uh, we'll carry on a little bit. Just want to get to like the next. The next kind of big point in the game. We need to make our way to the lighthouse. So we'll make our way to the lighthouse. Because uh, then Friday we should be able to just crack out the last couple hours of the game. Or the last hour or so. It's not a very long game, the first Silent Hill. Yeah, well, I suppose for the day, uh, I think it's about six or seven hours long. I suppose for the day, it was quite long. But I don't know whether I'm just going through it quite quickly because some of the puzzles, like I know the piano puzzle got people stumped. Yeah. Well, didn't they prove actually that wagon wheels are actually smaller now? I remember that being a thing, maybe. What's this? Oh. Oh. Yeah, the piano puzzle was a nightmare. Uh, but I, I vaguely know what it is now. Uh, a lot of the puzzles in this game are to do with colours. So with that one, it's the colour of the birds. Oh, can't go that way. Oh. I'd really quite like to play uh, Police Noughts or Snatcher next. Oh, I thought he was going to jump on me then. I've never played either. Uh, if you're not aware, Police Noughts and Snatcher are like two adventure games that Hideo Kojima made before. Uh, Metal Gear Solid. Uh, I've been reading this book, uh, quite a good book actually, called The Kojima Code, uh, which basically like describes how Kojima got to making Metal Gear Solid in the first place, and then some of the philosophies behind the game design. 
Uh, really good book. I do recommend it if you're a fan of Kojima. Mm. I'm wondering gloss here. Oh, I've completely missed it, that's why. Uh, so I'd, I'd quite like to play those eventually. Uh, but I'm not sure if like adventure games are fun to watch on Twitch. I make it. It's funny you mentioned PT. We were talking about that earlier because MG was uh, saying there's people on Twitch streaming PT, and I was like, uh, "Yeah, you can actually access PT still if you've deleted the game." Uh, for a custom firmware, uh, or you can carry on playing it if you never deleted it. Uh, PT was a very good experience. Although I have to say, I, I did thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy Death Stranding. Uh, I did have a lot of problems with it, but overall, as, a, as an experience, I really loved it. I thought it was much, much better than MGS5. I'm very excited for what he does next. Sybil. Harry. How did you get back here? I followed the sewer. Were you the one who cut the fence? Yeah. I'm glad you made it. I was worried about you. You were worried? Where did you disappear to? Never mind. I want to know what's going on here. What is with this town? This may sound really off the wall, but listen to me. You've got to believe me. I haven't gone crazy, and I'm not fooling around. At first, I thought I was losing my mind. But now I know I'm not. It's not me. This whole town. It's being invaded by the other world world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. Little by little, the invasion is spreading, trying to swallow up everything in darkness. I think I'm finally beginning to understand what that lady was talking about. Harry, hold on a minute. I don't get it. Look, I don't understand it all myself. I guess I can't explain it. What's making this happen? I don't know that either. But I do know Cheryl is there. There? Under whoever created this darkness. Cheryl is somewhere and she needs my help. Harry. This whole thing's been a major blow to you. You need to rest. Sybil, I... The demon is awakening, spreading those wings! Dahlia Gillespie. Was it not as I said? I see it all now. Yes, everything. Hungry for sacrifice, the demon will swallow up the land. I knew this day would come. And what's more, the task is almost finished. There's only two left. To seal this town to the abyss, the mark of Samael. When it is completed, all is lost. Even in daytime, darkness will cover the sun. The dead will walk, and martyrs will burn in the fires of hell. Everyone will die. So what am I supposed to do? I've got to save Cheryl. 
It is simple. Stop the demon. The demon, the demon taking that child's form. Stop it before your daughter becomes a sacrifice. Before it is too late. Stop it! Stop it! What do I do? Go to the lighthouse on the lake. And to the center of the amusement park. Make haste. You are the only hope. Look, Harry. I really don't get what's going on. But if there's a chance we can save your daughter, I'm in. I'll check out the amusement park. You go to the lighthouse. Sybil, thanks. Playing this game through really again. Use it. Oh, use what? I thought the cutscenes over them. The flowers. Only with that can you stop it. What about Sybil? Yeah, playing this game again, uh, voice acting wise, I feel like the voice actors are actually quite good for the time it was made. I feel like they take the game quite seriously. In comparison to, say, uh, Silent Hill 2, where the voice acting is kind of weird, it's kind of got that David Lynch intentionally bad kind of voice acting. Uh, I do have to wonder whether that was intentional from the developers. Or whether it was just a different voice cast. Uh, but anyway, uh, let me just... Uh, but yeah, absolutely love Death Stranding, argue by this. Pop that on. Uh, thank you for everyone who's come out today. Uh, had a really good time. Uh, like I said, we're going to go and raid Kokyu now. Uh, he's a relatively new streamer, as far as I'm aware. Uh, working on that affiliate grind. Uh, but he's a really lovely person. Uh, they usually play Minecraft. Uh, so if you're going to stick around for the raid, uh, great if you chuck him a follow and hung out in the chat, even if he has lurked. If you're going to head off elsewhere, have a really good evening. Uh, yeah, uh, sorry you came in towards the end, argue, but I really uh, thank you for coming in. Uh, it means a lot. Uh, I really enjoy being in your streams. Uh, so it's it's a great honour to have someone like yourself pop in. Uh, I'll be back Friday, probably about half four again, because that seems to work for everyone. Uh, so I'll be back at half four on Friday, uh, and, and we'll... Ah, oh, thank you for the bits, my friend. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you in your next stream, hopefully. I'll try and pop in uh, when you're next live. Uh, just... Any lurkers, if you've enjoyed today, I don't know why the final's not playing. Uh, but any lurkers, uh, if you want to follow on the channel, you can. If not, if you want to hop in the Discord, uh, you'll know when I go live there. Uh, if not, let's go and raid. Thank you. Uh, great to see you over there. And if you chuck in the follows as well, that would be lovely. I'm sure you appreciate it. Uh, see you, everyone else. Have a great evening. See you later.